And skipping cutscene. Salutations, I'm just Mike, and welcome back to Shadows of the Glasses. We did that speed run yesterday. Two days ago. Because I'm not doing these all in a row again. Uh, we're doing this one now. Doing that speed run, and then we're going to fight that Colossus. And that'll make this series about 16 Colossi shorter. <laughs> Because I do need to beat all of these in time trial mode. I guess I'm going for all of the trophies. Which means I'll probably have to look into some speedrunning tactics. Bow out, bow out, come on, take a bot. We've got to get in front of this big thing. Come on now, we it around. Here we go now, is it going to do the big steppy? Here we go now, we'll find out if it goes up to do the big stomp. Come and step on me, daddy! <laughs> oh, I can only hope that my delay makes that line up appropriately. Alright, which leg's front? Which, this leg's front. Perfect. Perfect. I appreciate it. That's exactly the leg that I needed out front. I was thinking about this yesterday. Well, you know, like ten minutes ago. And what I'm thinking is, we're gonna do like two light stabs in the middle. Oh, that's what I was looking for. Da -na 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 This is fucking badass, don't you think so? This is such an epic time for a battle. Okay, so we did two steps there. We're gonna move on to the butt and then the head, and we're gonna wrap back around to this one. Because I need to regain stamina, and that's the most efficient way to get that taken care of. Step. Draw back and oh shit! I lost my grip a little bit. Is that it for this one? Is there one more light stab? How much is left on this sigil? Okay. All right. So now we gotta. Work on making it up to his head. Regaining stamina along the way. Now this... This is fucking gorgeous. We are two minutes uh, ahead of where the goal is. I think that'll be doable, no problem. We just have to be a little patient. Because this is, this is where he can do the most to us. He might need to regain stamina on his little shoulder shroom. He's throwing us around again. 253, okay. Alright, alright. I gotta be honest, I'm a little nervous. I mean, these are the high, these are the hard speed runs. Oh, cool, Miles Morales had an update. Maybe there will be slightly less bugs in it. All right. All right, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. All right, climb up. Climb up on him. Run, 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 run. Get on his shoulders. Get on his shoulders. Get on his shoulders. Okay. All right. All right. I think we're good. I think we're good. We've regained plenty of stamina for another stab to his fucking cranium. Less than a minute. Less than a minute. It's fine. Most of his health is gone. Most of his health is gone. We should be perfectly fine. That should be the last stab that we needed. Okay. Alright, so we just gotta swing around a little. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Alright. I think I got this. I think I got this. Oh, I think I got this. Huh. 
Oh, dear God. Oh, no. This is so tight. This is so fucking tight. This is so fucking tight. All right, all right, all right. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, fucking hell! Two, 429.9. Oh my god, that was so fucking close. Oh, perhaps my strategy was a very poor one. Of course, I made some mistakes along the way, so that makes sense. I did move too far back along him. Oh, take me, wispy daddies. Take me, wispy daddies. 0.6 seconds from the goal. Holy crap, I could do so much better. I imagine speedruns are fucking terrifying low numbers on there. Um, but holy shit, that was... That was intense. And new item in that little lake back there. You wanna come with me? Let's go to that lake back there. Grab a pick us up an item, see what it is. And then we go and do this fight in a lot less of a stressful setting. That's gonna be lovely, isn't it? Here we are. <laughs> Harpoon of Thunder! Yes! We can't use that in speedruns, but do I have to equip it here? Okay, it's already equipped. Wonderful. If we press left twice, boom! Thunder boom! Let's harpoon us the second Colossus, shall we? We can get those shots on his side. See how much damage we can inflict from the ground before climbing up on him. Maybe I shouldn't be playing with my mules this way. This sounds incredibly dangerous. But it sounds incredibly fun as well. And it's something that I haven't tried before, so. New experiences in this game. I have to, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna look up what tricks you can do on aggro. Because you can stand on his back. I've gotten on his side one. I don't remember how I even did that, though. Yeah. Oh, man, I can't wait to Thunderboon this fucker. I think there's a coin somewhere somewhere in the water down there. There's nothing really over there that I found when I was exploring on my own. I don't... Well, I'm pretty sure collecting all of the coins is something, but I definitely want to use a guide for that rather than scouring this entire place on my own because that, that feels like a pretty strong way to not to, to sort of ruin it for myself that's not the way I necessarily enjoy games so using a guide is much much better for me in my opinion and if you enjoy that kind of stuff without a guide more power to you I mean the reason that they put coins around this game is because so many people were convinced that there was a there was a eight seventeenth Colossus. That's how they discovered the secret garden at the top of there after three playthroughs. Uh, it's how it's the reason that they hid so many coins around. They knew that in that time, years after the game had been released, people were still playing it and scouring every square inch of the land just searching. So, they decided to reward those players. The people who had given such time and dedication to it. And, quite frankly, that's a beautiful thing. It's just not for me. It's like... It's like... Art. that makes sense like 
Everyone has their preferences in artistry and stuff. Mine happens to be these really giant fucking monsters fall into the ground. I love fighting them so much. And the music that accompanies it. Oh yeah, bring in that strings. I'm gonna sh throw some thunder poons into the side of this fucking behemoth. Alright. First things first, if we are gonna throw thunder poons at him, I need to... I need to lead him out. So that I can try to get around to his side. I'm sorry, Agro. I didn't mean to rush you. Up. Okay, this isn't working. Hold on. Maybe? Huh? It seemed to have worked that time. No, no. No, no. I don't want to be on that side of you. Stop turning that way, and it's all it's all good. We're all good. Hup. Yeah, no, I know that one's there. That's the one I'm trying to hit. Ah, go! What the fuck were you doing? Up. Really? fucking around, okay? Don't give me too much shit for it. Up! Up, 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 up. I don't know if you know this, but we got a giant motherfucker to climb. Up! Something tells me he is not happy about this. Haha. <laughs> There's one of my thunder pooms. Hey. All right. He's shaking his thigh. He's shaking his thigh. I don't talk about living in people's thighs, Estelle. Uh, big stab. Doing so much more damage. I wonder why. Do I have a special sword equipped? I shouldn't. Nothing there. Nothing there. Alright, alright, alright. Up. Up. Climb up over. Didn't I say I'd turn off his chips? Hold on a second. Why was he talking at me? Hold on a second. Why did that happen? Oh, shake all you want, it won't matter. You see how much stamina I have? It's in the lower right-hand corner of the screen, bitch. Get stabbed! Alright. So that's all we're gonna get out of that one. Okay. Alright. Alright. Okay. And up and go. Up and go.
It's like right here. Now that was more like it. My Thunderpoon won't do it. Fine. I'll do it my damn self. Hell yeah! <laughs> This game is fucking gorgeous. Ugh. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, that was the first time I was able to get on aggro, though. Oh, I was hoping maybe I'd be able to race those wisps around. Uh, but that'll do it for this episode. Thank you guys very much for watching. Remember to take care of yourselves so that tomorrow's another day. I hope to see you then. Mm -hmm.